All right, so today's the day. Dad and I are going up to uh, Old Forge to check out the Blizzard dealer. Hopefully going to pick out a pretty awesome trailer for this season, give us a little bit more ability to travel and kind of see more areas in the Northeast. And if all things work out, head up to Canada and ride with the boys for the podcast. So uh, I'll keep you guys filled in as the day goes on. And uh, here we go. We got Rob all ready to go. Look at him. Briefcase and drinks. Making his big purchase. Had to go up to Old Forge. Atta boy. Look at you go on the camera. Look at that teal color. Where? Over here? Yeah. I guess it's more like a green. Yeah, but... that's a green, I think. Yeah. I like the two tone, but I like the I like this color too. I knew you'd like the blue. That's why I kept telling I mean, you. It doesn't make any sense to get Yeah, blue. but who cares? It's never gonna eternally match the sleds. We change the color of the sleds all the time. You know? I almost think like uh like the charcoal front and the blue back. She was saying charcoal and blue both yeah. really good. Does that short one have that? That, that would break. Yeah. You know what that would do also? Hmm. I, I like blue, but a whole blue trailer almost looks like I bought one out of stock and that's what they had. Yeah. But if I customize it, yeah. gray and blue, now it's mine. Yeah. You know? I agree. Yeah. And, it's, and you know I like to be unique. It's different than black and yeah. gray. And, Different than everybody. Me? Let's go look at our trailer. Yeah. Now, that's See, it's got the fuel doors. Yeah, but it's got the. They have the wheels a little farther apart on them. Yeah, that's their style. Too. But it helps it track straighter. Does it? Uh, although you'll have a little more trouble in parking lots, it's supposed to help it track straighter when you're going down the road, which would be nice because you know how ours bounces and everything. Right. The whole trailer. Yeah. There's not much for blocks under it. Nice. Put that down. That's okay. Now your buddy was saying he took that off him. I think he broke it off, didn't he? I thought he broke it. Oh, he might have. Smells nice and new. Hey, you're right though. No fuel doors. Why is that? You're included. Yeah. I thought you didn't want lighting. Uh, I thought you didn't want the lighting. It comes from lighting. I didn't want to upgrade. Oh, gotcha. I think. We'll check. I think. Well, this trail is huge. Yeah, there's your spare. Yeah, that's included. Yep. I'm a little worried that the sleds might slip on these. It's not very. What will that be? Yeah. I mean, if you had studs, obviously it's going to go right up and down it, but. Uh, do you think this is going to be long enough for ours back to back? Yeah. This and looks... you can have the other ones, you know what I mean? This looks wicked long, yeah. There's a two-tone black and gray. Ooh, that's hot. Yeah. What that's a you, staggered... What do you think? It's nice. I, I'm a proponent, you like blue, get blue. There you go, now you're a pro. This has the thing, look. Oh, is it that light? I think yours is broken, though. Yeah. I'll do a look at this. That's nice, yeah. Yeah, it's a beauty. Oh, I absolutely love it. That's crazy. Like the back one doesn't work like that. I mean, it seemed heavy when you brought it down. That's nice. Yeah. So now we have to ask how much different. I think that these are the same lights. I'm hoping recessed. I think I read that. I mean, it seems like every trailer has those, so. A little heavier. Much heavier. I imagine these are upgraded wheels, huh? Those ones are nice. I think that's what Bob has on his. Yeah, probably. 
Yeah, though, that's probably more like what we'd end up with. Oh, we have to answer. Okay. I don't like the standard ones up. up. I'm sure it's just that. Only we would shop for a trailer on like a 70 degree day. Yeah. Now let me ask you a question. How much different than that is the one I'm looking at? That one might be six inches taller and might be two feet longer. Yeah, you know, see, there's anything like the one I'm looking at around I can look at. I did like the length of that one. How much more is it? I think it's two feet longer and six hundred dollars. They both have like my sled's one forty four. They'll fit in. Either way? Yeah. Okay. Well I guess if it'll fit in the smaller one, there's no sense getting a bigger one. Yeah. Where I'm at, I can't get Oh really? Oh no. It's kind of cool to see it from a customer standpoint. I've never seen the trailers look like that. Yeah. Well, my guy who does all the lighter frames, yeah. he's a worker. Oh, yeah. He's got his own little corner. He never bothers anybody, never complains, never says a word. He puts these things out so fast you wouldn't believe it. That's awesome. I watch him like, I don't know how he can do it so fast. Because then the guys that are experienced on the big line, yeah. when he's out for a week, they try to do his. It takes him like three days to do one. <laughs> like five in a day. Wow. Wow, that one right there. Okay. That doesn't look too much. So that one out front is taller also? That one, yep. You can okay. tell by the side man door. Yeah. So the black one there? Yep, the black one is exactly what you're looking at. Which, you didn't look at the other one, but then you gotta think, like when we shot the boat, get it away from the other boat and it looks too big. Yeah. It doesn't look. Oh, it's got the fuel source. Yeah. Well, you don't want to be any taller. Well, yeah. your helmet. Yeah. I just, would, you just have to learn not to come in with your helmet on. Well, how about me? You're fine. You could probably got like yeah, I don't. Four, four or five inches. Do I? Yeah. yeah. So I'd be all right. But we would ride in and just take your helmet off. Yeah, I, and I think for purposes of towing and all that other stuff, I'd rather have one that's less like towing a house, personally. No, I yeah. don't. You never like the size of yeah. it. Yeah. I get that. This is going to be real important. I want both sides to fit, or I'm going to get the other one. I think they will, because... I, I, I want to know, though. Yeah, we can look up, but you also got to keep in mind there's going to be some overlap with like rear bumper to front bumper. So the ski, you don't even have to go all the way to the skis, you know? They yeah, can but, tuck into but, each other a little bit. But, but yeah, I know. But think about it, you have um, mud flaps too. Yeah. So it's not like you can tuck under. No, I know. I don't want to tuck under, I yeah. want it big enough. Yeah. If it's not big enough, I'm gonna get the other one. I'm gonna do this one time. Yeah. We can ask about those. So inside those would be a This box, seems right? probably like standard lighting because this has two, the other one had four. So it probably comes with two standard. He probably upgraded yeah. to four, Which, but we have zero, so. Yeah, no, exactly. Yeah. There's all your fuses, that's kind of cool. I saw that. Yeah, yeah that, that's pretty cool. Yeah. I like that, look at that. That is. Is that light up? No, but it's... it's just like... Maybe. Translucent? Yeah. Yeah. That's hot. Whoa. Oh, nice, opens. See, it went out to the step. Yeah. Um, yeah, you probably couldn't get up in there. What? It'd even be a stretch for me. I just don't want the step, and I was trying to explain it to her, I don't want the step in the way of the tire. Yeah. Here. Well, she said she could put the door wherever. Yeah. Well, I don't want to way up there either, though. Yeah. Because but ideally, even if they had to move that light a little bit, I, yeah. would, I want it straddled, because I want to be able to gas the sleds on this side, too, through this door. Yeah. I'm not sure if I want them to put the flap on the front or not. Yeah. I'm thinking I do because at our house we use the flap. Mm -hmm. Even if you had a board under it, it would transition a lot nicer. Yeah. This this is all all you're gonna do on this thing is you're good unless oh, yeah. you use this. Now, honestly, off. this looks a lot thicker than the one we already have. Like well, that's, that's pretty substantial. And if you use this for off only, you're fine, but if you ever try to load yeah. all the time, yeah. you're gonna hit your uh, your carbines. Yeah. This front door is it's so light. Beautiful. That's wild. And the back door is heavy. Yeah. This front door is just I, I figured it would just I figured it would just be like the back door. 
You know, that's crazy. This front door is crazy. Yeah. But you know what? You get it away from the other boat. Yeah, it looks great. It's beautiful. And I got the long trek back out front. Go for the hip. Blood. Go ahead. The hip. You got a half done one. That's yeah, cool. that's interesting. Don't often get to see how they're put together. Yeah. I just want to. That wood looks so new. Pretty heavy. Yeah. It says a lot about how light they are. Yeah. That's interesting. So these are called Snow Squall by Blizzard Manufacturing. So they must like farm some out too. Sure. Yeah. It's cool. There's a flurry. Yeah. Another flurry. See, this is like kind of what Robin Speedy has. This is a short little guy, huh? Yeah, that's like our old one. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at my house though, where yeah. I park it, we, we use that door. Going up? In and up. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he does a lot. He pulls them off, he films stuff, he, put, uh, he puts parts Are you going to drive up that front ramp? At yeah. Times? So I was sometimes, thinking, yeah. I was thinking I need I'm one of these. Yeah. Because you'll want that. Okay. Good. Yeah. Thank you. Awesome. We talk, we, we kind of kicked that around when we were outside. Do you by any chance know the overall length? Sure like does. without the V? Like just where the sleds would sit? 20. 20 feet? 20 plus 5. Okay. That one out there is 22. I just looked it up. That one's 22. So your sled from ski tip to mud flap is 11 feet long. Uh, when am I going to get my cars? So you got to remember too, when you put them in. That's what I was trying to tell them earlier. That the track can go back behind the skis. Yeah. So if the one sled, the skis can actually be on the V and I can still hit the tie down? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right. But it goes right to the right to the front. Yeah. So I think it'll be fine. So we could still do that. Yeah. yeah. And so finally, he ended up with a staggered one like this, mm -hmm. and he's like, "Finally, I love this trailer." I'm like, "Oh my god, I got to get this on tape." <laughs> see, because the, he did have one of these, but he didn't like it because he couldn't see around it. But his sleds fit in fine. Yeah, I can drive. Mine's like this. But this one, you can see around it. I do like to tow these better. I this is much better with, with, so with his, yeah, yeah with as much experience I have towing and he does that with a bigger trailer it doesn't, yeah. it, it's I mean we, we actually jack it around the house backwards mm -hmm. in, in a snowstorm so the biggest thing for us too is our buddy he oh, doesn't ride every week so mm -hmm. if they're staggered we'd have to really Move finagle take the his sleds every time. Yeah. Middle or stop. been hot I got shorts and a t-shirt my friend I almost wore a long sleeve so we got a 2021 four place Trailer over the tires, so not staggered. Yes. 20 foot from the start of the V, or the end of the V, to the back of the trailer. Yeah. Let's, start, the, let's start talking like, like a salesman. Like what? Completely mats and, and rails, yeah. completely through the whole thing. Yeah. It's got fuel doors, it's got a man door with a step, it's got the... Uh, uh, springs on the front and rear door for easy. The front springs open. were pretty impressive. We were yeah. we were very impressed with those. Like this. Yeah, much better than the one we currently have. Yeah, and she threw the flap in. Yeah, flap for free. My dumbass almost said, "How much does that cost?" Well, Bob, thankfully I didn't speak. Yeah, well, you know that's why you bring the old dad. Yeah, I was real close to saying it too. Um, and then we got a sidestep. Sometimes dad knows. Yeah. No we, helmet racks, those weren't worth it, we helmet thought. Helmet racks, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, Just we, kind of a metal box that would yeah. scratch up your helmet. Yeah, I can I can actually build uh, helmet shelves cheaper and uh, more useful. Yep, absolutely. So, yeah. And then the total cost was eleven eight ninety three out the door. Yep, tax so. and fees and everything. And the Triton, which would have been very similar, was 14 and change with the plus, track mats and stuff. Plus tax. Plus tax, so. So you would be yeah. 16 out the door. Yeah. So still a huge savings and we were able to get two tone. I don't know if I already said that. And we, we customized got, the color too. Yeah. What color, Bob? Blue in the back, charcoal in the front. So Blue that in should the look back, pretty awesome. Charcoal in the front. Yep. Chrome accents throughout. Yep. Should be real sharp. Should be awesome. Yeah, Great job, Brad Park. All right, nice job, Park. Good stuff.